Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman here with ProMMANow.com. This UFC newcomer, John Moraga, who's taking on Ulysses Gomez, UFC on Fox, Saturday, the first fight on the card. What do you think about being the first fight? It's good, man. Get to get it over with and go watch the rest of the fights. <laughs> it's like getting yourself a free ticket, right? Yep, exactly. All right. Uh, how long have you been training in MMA? This must be a dream come true to finally make it to the big show. Yeah, I've been going hard for about four years now, maybe a little over four years. What should uh, the fans know about you as a fighter? What's kind of like your style, your strengths? I throw them chingazos, man. So I'm ready. I come Is that to throwing time. bolos? Because I need some, some translation. Uh, that's throwing them, them haymakers, dog, all day. Haymakers. Now, nah, well, you'll see technique, though, but I, I come to throw. You know, I come to fight. I don't come to, I, I come from a wrestling base, but I don't come to wrestle, so. You well, it seems, it seems Ulysses wants to make it a good fight, too. We just interviewed him, and, uh, you know, hopefully you guys started out right that way because it kind of sets the tone for the whole night sometimes. Yeah, definitely. We'll, I think it'll be a good fight to set the tone, and I think we're going to make UFC real happy. What, uh, what, who are some of your coaches or the gym you train at? I train out of ACS, which is uh, Arizona Combat Sports, and the MMA lab back in Phoenix. Trevor Lally and John Crouch are my two head trainers. Uh, I've got my, my old high school wrestling coach who's been with me the whole ride, Richard Fembris, and uh, all three of them will be in my corner. So. Is Arizona Combat, is that where Bader? Is that Bader's gym or no? No, that's where they started out. Uh, okay. they, they're at the, they got their own gym now, but that's uh, Varner's there, Jeremy Larson, uh, Cliff Starks. Uh, okay. Have you, you Varner's Varner's what two weight classes above you? Well, three weight classes above you. So is he too big for you to work out with leading up to the fight, or has he been one of your like sparring partners? Uh, you know, I, I spar with him. I can spar with him. He's pretty good about like you know he still beats me up a little bit, but he doesn't he doesn't overdo it. But um, he's he's a good workout partner. But uh, lately, I, I spent the last uh, two or three two weeks over there with uh, Ben and that those guys at, at the lab. We okay. were in Flagstaff, so I was my last two weeks have been with those guys. But I, I'm back and forth between both gyms throughout my training camp. That's Benson Henderson. Yeah. What's he like to roll with? <sighs> He'll let you choke him, and you still can't. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He's, right he's, on. He's, he's he's crazy. You've seen his fights with Cowboy. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I don't want to hold you up too much because it looks like you're about to go running. Keep keep the the weight cut starting. Um, anything else you want to talk about or plug? Uh, just follow me on Twitter at Chicano John. Uh, follow my gyms, Arizona Combat Sports, MMA Lab. Just want to say thanks to everybody. What's up? Maryvale, West Phoenix. What up? Hook it up in Spanish if you want. Go go for the Telemundo crowd. Right now. Uh, I'm Chicano, boy. I, my my no. Spanish ain't too good. No. I don't want to piss anybody off. Really? <laughs> I'm Chicano. Straight. We speak Spanglish. Dang. All right. Well, thank you very much. All right. All right. Good luck, buddy. Thank